Mathematics Alive, Algebra Lesson 5, Special Product Formulas, Numbers 1 and 2. We still have the Special Products Formula, Numbers 3 and 4, in my next video. And let's start with number 1. Product of the sum and difference of the same two terms. Of the form a plus b times a minus b is equal to a squared minus b squared. But you can switch the factors and you can still get the same answer. So let's go to the derivation of the formula. We start with a times a. So we have a squared a times b plus a b and then negative b times a and negative b times b. So we have negative a b and negative b times b, negative b squared. And we get a squared and this is 0 and the last term is negative b squared. So the answer is a squared minus b squared. So you just memorize the formula because you don't need to go through the long multiplication. That saves you time in your uh, future computations. So here are some examples. 3x plus 2 times 3x minus 2. Here a is equal to 3x and b is equal to 2. So we will just use the formula. We first square a and then square b and get the difference of the two. So we square 3x and you have 9x squared and you square 2. So the answer is 9x squared minus 4. Number 2, y squared plus 4 times y squared minus 4. a is equal to y squared and b is equal to 4. So you square y squared and you have y to the 4th minus the square of 4, 16. And that's your answer. And Number 3, 5x minus 6y times 5x plus 6y, where a is equal to 5x and b is equal to 6y. And your answer is 5x squared, that's 25x squared minus 36y squared. Now let's move on to our second special product formula, the square of a binomial. a plus b quantity squared is equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. Let's go to the derivation of the formula. We simply multiply a plus b by itself and we have a times a, <coughs> a squared, a times b, plus AB, and then B times A, another AB, and B times B, B squared. So, the result is A squared <coughs> plus 2AB plus B squared. <coughs> you find it here. And we can also demonstrate that geometrically, by um, forming a square with dimensions a plus b, so this is a and this is b, so the sides are a plus b and times a plus b. <coughs> and if you look at the dimensions, this square formed is a by a or a squared. And these two rectangles are B times A or AB. A times B or another 
A, B. And lastly, we have B times B or B squared. So, in this illustration, we have A squared plus 2AB plus B squared. So, um, applying the formula, let's go to the examples. 2X plus 3Y quantity squared. So, we have the A here is equal to 2X and B is equal to 3Y. <clears throat> and then, we will simply follow the formula, substituting the values of A and B. So, 2x is um, to be squared. So, 2x squared is 4x squared. Plus, you multiply this, that is AB, and then multiply it by 2. You always remember that this is a constant times 2. <clears throat> so you get the product that is 6xy times 2. So we get 12xy plus 3y quantity squared. So you have 9y squared. <clears throat> and that's your answer. Number 2, we have 5x minus 2y. <coughs> In this case, we have a is equal to 5x and b is equal to negative 2y. <coughs> so, we square the first term. 25x squared. We get the product of these two. So, we have 10 and then duplicate it times 2. So, we get negative 20xy plus square of the last term, we have 4y squared. <coughs> and lastly, we have 6y plus z over 2 quantity squared, where this is our a and this is our b. So, we square the first term, 36y squared plus 2 times the product of the 2, 6y times z over 2 plus the square of the last term, z squared over 4. Then that simplify the middle term. <clears throat> These two cancels. So the final answer is 36y squared plus 6yz plus z squared over 4. In my next video, I will be introducing the third formula and the fourth special product formula. So, please follow my next video. And if you think this is helpful, please share it with your friends. Please like it, share it, and subscribe to this channel by clicking the button below. Thank you very much for watching and bye-bye.